Perfect. There we go. Wonderful. That'll go in tomorrow. Um, Liv, I saw you doing some some workout on the pitch at the end of the game on on Saturday. You raring to go? Yeah. Um, it's been a difficult uh, probably six or seven weeks for me in terms of trying to get to get ready for for the, the up and coming games. Um, we had a bit a few setbacks during the rehab, but yeah, feel good now and hopefully back on track. What was the the injury exactly? Um, I just had a knee issue. I uh, picked it up in the game against Plymouth. Uh, it was just a, an ongoing thing, really. I took a heavy bang on it. Um, wasn't sure at the time if if I potentially needed a surgery or or, or was it just going to settle down by itself. But um, yeah, it was just a bit of a knee issue. Uh, yeah, but now fe- feeling good and hopefully ready to go. Uh, and you come into the cl- uh, the team obviously at a difficult time. What have you made watching from the sidelines of, of what's gone on over the last few weeks? Yeah, I'm, you can say we're in a difficult patch um, for, for, for me and and the, the lads. Know it's um, it's just a case of scoring goals in terms of the way we've been playing and defensively or or, or in between the two boxes. We're probably up there. Um, we're just missing that that goal at the minute. Um, I think once once we we start scoring, we'll we'll get back on track. And do you feel that that's just the at the moment? It's just that little thing that needs to click for for suddenly the results and the wins to start flowing. Yeah, I think probably up until the the Portsmouth game, it was probably what was five unbeaten. Um, we was in a good good place, uh, but at the minute, we just like like I said, we're just lacking goals. Um, and I think once we we start to get the goals, I think the the results will come. And have you noticed some of the younger players who might be experiencing uh, first team football for the first time this season? Has it hit them hard this run? Do you think? Yeah, it's a learning curve for them. We've still got a very young squad, there, and even the players were probably here last season. Um, yeah, many of them probably wouldn't have had this in their career. Um, so it, it's going to happen. I think the longer that the lads go on in terms of their careers and that, they're going to find themselves in situations like this. It's, it's it's a learning curve as part of football um, and it's just how you react and how you overcome it. And do you as a more experienced pro have to just tell them to play your play their own game and not to be affected by what's going on at the moment? Yeah, definitely. I think it, that's one of my roles in in the in the group. I think, yeah, we, we know we're not picking up the, the results that we that we want. Um, but like I said, it, it, it's not down to our performances it's just uh, just in case it's the case of not scoring enough goals um and yeah it's just just uh, keep keep on top of the lads keep the confidence high um and we don't really need to change anything it's just in terms of just getting the goals now